Hey guys, back again. Wanted to read another story. Uh, try and power through these so that you can have them facing the right way. I feel really bad that all those other ones that I have recorded previously were backwards. Anyways, let's read it the right way. This is The Shape of Me and Other Stuff by one of my favorites, Dr. Seuss. He wrote and illustrated this book. You know, it makes a fellow think. The shape of you, the shape of me, the shape of everything I see. A bug, a balloon, a bed, a bike. No shapes are ever quite alike. Just think about the shape of beans and flowers and mice and big machines. Just think about the shape of strings and elephants and other things. The shape of lips, the shape of ships, the shape of water when it drips. Peanuts and pineapples, noses and grapes, everything thing comes in different shapes. Why, George, you're right. And think about the shape of gum, the many shapes of chewing gum. And the shape of smoke and marshmallows and fires and mountains and roosters and horses and tires. The, and the shape of camels and the shape of bees and the wonderful shapes of backdoor keys. And the shapes of spider webs and clothes. And speaking of shapes now, just suppose. Suppose you were shaped like these or those or shaped like a blog or a garden hose. <clears throat> of all the shapes we might have been, I say hooray for the shapes we're in. The end. I love a Dr. Seuss book. I love a good rhyme. And I love the shapes, the shape of me and other stuff because it lets you know it's okay to be you. Be you and the body that you're in and love yourself and just live your best life. I hope you have a great night and I'll see you later.